hi guys in this step by step video i'm going to be showing you how to activate shopify payments for non-usa citizens now this is a big problem for a lot of people do you want to um like activate shopify payments but they don't like they don't see the option to activate the shopify payments and also shopify payments is not supported by all countries there are specific countries where you can activate Shopify payments. I'm just going to search for Shopify payments available countries and you will see that um, you can only activate Shopify payments in the US, US, USA, okay, and Australia and Canada and Denmark, Finland, France, Germany, Ireland, Italy. Now, if you live in another country, let's say you live in Africa or you live in some country where you cannot be, you cannot use shopify payments this video is for you i'm going to be showing you guys exactly how you can activate shopify payments um if you live outside of the us okay um now first thing you need to do guys you want to log into your shopify store that's the first step okay now keep in mind this is this is not an easy thing to do okay this there are some requirements that you have um, to provide so that you will be accepted into the Shopify payments. Now I'm going to be showing you in a few seconds the requirements and also how you can, like I said, how you can activate Shopify payments even if you live outside of the US. Okay. Now, as you can see here, guys, um, the, like make sure just log in into your Shopify store. As you can, this is my Shopify store. As you can see here, you want to click on settings. Okay and you want to click on payments and after guys you click on payments now if you don't live in uh, a country where shopify payments is supported you will not see shop activate shopify payments in the top here you will only see here payment providers uh which are like third party uh or like it's payment methods at, at uh, as you can see it says here providers that enable you to accept payments methods at a rate set by a third party additional fee will apply to a new orders once you select a plan now even if you click on choose provider you will not be able guys to activate shopify payments now what you guys need to do is you want to go to store details okay you want to click on store details and you want to click where it says here billing information you want to click on this pen button here and you need to change the location to a location where shopify payments are supported now like i said these are countries where you can uh, uh you can uh, like use shopify payments i'm going to search for that right now shopify payments available countries okay now as you can see one of these countries is australia Belgium, canada Denmark, finland germany ireland okay now what you guys need to do okay is you need to select a country where shopify pens are accepted one of them is united states now after you select the country where the shopify payments are accepted if you click on payments as you can see here if you click now on payments after you change the country you will see here shopify payments but the problem is how you can get the usa uh, address how you can get ssn which SSN is very sp like only you people who live in the United States they have uh, access to SSN. Okay, that's a very unique number that the government give to the the people that live in uni in United States. So how you can have that SSN if you don't live in United States? Now that's today's video. I'm gonna be showing you guys what you need so that you can activate Shopify payments, okay? Now, like I said, change the country to United States and you wanna click on activate Shopify payments. And also you wanna click on, um, yeah, you wanna uncheck this, okay? If it displays something like this, just uncheck it and click on continue. Just wait a few seconds and after that, as you can see, it says here, submit information about your business. Click on submit details. And here where it says business type, if you select, for example, individual, they will ask you guys for SSN. And that SSN number is very special, like you cannot have it 
except you live in the United States. Now, what you guys need to do instead, you want to select LCC, okay? Now, like after you select LCC, you will ask you guys for uh, employer, uh, employer. I hope I pronounced it correctly. My English is not that good. But anyway, I am going to explain to you guys how you can activate Shopify payments. Just watch this video till the end. Everything um, will be explained in this video. Or social security number assistant. Now, they ask you guys for social security number assistant or identification number AN. Okay. Now, if you select individual where it says here, um, like business type if you select for example individual you will not be able to have an option to enter their identification number which is an okay now this ad this addit uh, identification number will be provided to you if you create our lcc in the united states there are a lot of companies that help you guys create lcc in the united states and they will give you all the information you need including this identific identification number they will give you the street address of the company and they will give you the legal business name which is the the legal business name is the name you used to create the the, the lcc now if you search for on google for um create lcc um lcc for non residents there are a lot of companies that will help you do that okay there are a lot of companies that will help you do that including this one as you can see wise lcc for no reasons how to guide they will give you all the information how to create lcc or how to form lcc as you can see start your non-resident lcc get a business bank account okay now getting a usa bank account is very easy okay now you just need to go to pioneer okay and create an account on pioneer and enter your personal information your uh, your home address where you live right now and then you will get the pioneer uh yeah you will get the pioneer bank account okay now that's if you don't know that because this is uh, everyone knows pioneer uh, gives you guys usa bank account that you are going to use to receive payments okay now like i said creating lcc as you can see there are a lot of videos that explain to you guys how you can open a lcc in the us as a non-resident okay there are a lot of videos that will explain to you as you can see how to form a usa lcc as non-resident in less than five minutes so there are like there are a lot of websites that help you guys create an lcc and they will give you all this information including the business legal business name which is the name you use to create lcc okay now the state you will enter here your state now where it says here personal uh, details you don't have to enter here the lcc information you need to enter your real information okay if you you need to enter here your real name your last name your job title date of birth street address and here you want to select your own country okay your correct country okay now where it says here assistant of course they are going to ask you again for social security number you just need to enter here the last uh, four digits of your identification number which is an okay you need to enter your four numbers the last four numbers of that aen uh, number you need to enter it in the social security number where they ask you guys for your social security number and also additional owners if you have like additional owner you want to click on add another owner owner or a director here it says business category you want to select your business okay if you are selling for example um cloud clothing and accessories you want to select that and you want to select the the like ca like select the product type which is sports and riding uh okay the description you just need to enter here the description of the product like what you are going to sell uh, on your shopify store and here you want to get the usa uh, phone number okay now like i said after you create an lcc you will be able to have access to usa phone number even if you if you are not if you don't have access to usa bank account there are i'm sorry to your usa phone number there are a lot of websites that offer uh numbers but you have to pay monthly for them 
now after you enter the phone number and after you enter all the information you want to click on submit for verification and your application will be accepted within 24 hours less than 24 hours keep in mind that you need an lcc okay that's that's the only problem here you need an lcc this is very important if you select for example individual here he will not be able guys to enter their the identification the, the like uh, they will ask you guys to enter their your ssn okay which is a real problem as you can see it says here ssn and they will ask you for that and you don't have access to ssn because you don't live in united states that's the problem like i said you have to select in the business type you want to select lcc and they give you guys two options which is the identification number which is an or social security number now the only thing you need to focus on like this number we will be provided uh, the, the, the comp like after you create after you form lcc you will be able to have this identification number which is an okay now the only thing you need to focus on is how to create lcc for how to open an lcc for non-residents of course you have to pay for the for the the company two hundred dollars like up from twenty five dollars to two hundred dollars per year if you want to register uh L your, like you want to register a company in um, in usa okay now that's exactly guys how you can uh, activate shopify payments for non uh, citizens uh, like uh, for non usa citizens okay so that's exactly guys how you can activate it i know this is not a complete tutorial but really it's going to take a lot of time to create lcc okay i don't have the information and also i'm not going to pay for it because i don't need it right now so that's why i'm not able guys to show you what exactly website that you are going to use to create an lcc but there are, there are a lot of websites and if you don't know guys what website just search on google for how to create lcc for non-residents and you will be able guys for non-usa residents uh, you will be able guys to create lcc or to form lcc if this video guys helped you please drop a like and subscribe to the channel see you guys in the next video